Dyro Beam LT is uh, moving into the heavier range now. This one measures 45 by 25. This one is typically used for bracing of uh, AC hole cutouts in roof panels in RVs. Okay, Styro question time. Can I run wiring through my walls and roof with my Styromax panels? And of course, with the use of Styro Conjute and Styro Beam, the answer is yes. You can start with the PVC range that we have, or you can move into the fiberglass pull truded range. They all vary and allow different amounts of wiring through. In some roof panels that we've done in the past, we've had a whole range of conjutes inside the panel, along with conjute triples, or perhaps even the single, branching off the same conjute small. Now that's all bonded in place, and then cavities are drilled in the panel to open up those cavities to get the wiring through. Frequently asked question here at Styromax is, can I interlink my conjutes? Well, the answer is yes, you can. Uh, but they don't interlock. So uh, I'll give you, show you a quick video on uh, how that takes place. Okay, so here's a typical uh, composite panel, not bonded so we can pull it apart. So there's the core. We would typically, if you wanted to have, say, a, uh, a cross intersection, we'd machine uh, the styrene to suit uh, the one piece going across and for the next two pieces going sideways. They could then be machined into the styrene like so. And of course, each end will have to be sealed, uh, which we do here in a process um, to prevent uh, glue entering the conduit during the uh, lamination process. But of course, once that's all bonded together, then over at the CNC routers, you can then cut a hole into the panel, which of course opens up all intersection points. Okay, styro question time. I am using 29 mil panel, either be it styro RV or styro trailer. What conduits can I use in that panel? Well, uh, the thickness of your panel, yeah, does restrict uh, what you can and can't put within the panel. You can certainly put a conduit single inside a 25 mil core, that will fit. The triple, that will fit. You can use the conduit small, 20 by 25, that will fit one way, or you can tip it on its side and use the other way. Conjute large, the 40 by 20, you can only lay that flat. That will not work if you put it on its edge. It's, uh, it's too high for the styrene core. Or you can also use Styro Beam LT. Again, that can only be flat. Can't be tipped over because it's too high. I'll skip RG. Styro Beam XHD, you cannot use at all. It is too big. You'll require a thicker core to use that beam. Uh, 